As members from our health care community continue to battle the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, they are faced with another problem. KAMR Local 4's Ali Cassetti shares how our frontline heroes are continuing to battle what seems like an uphill battle against the spread of misinformation. We're blessed to live in a free country and people can say lots of different things. And to quote a relative of mine, you can't cure stupid. Local health experts once again reminding everyone that social media sites are not where you should be seeking information or medical advice. Unfortunately, um, that is something that, that we don't have a way to be able to stop or to block. That's one of the great things about living in the U.S. is I can say whatever I want. 20 months into the pandemic and things are still constantly changing. So it is understandable that many people, including women who are expecting, still have questions. But one of my patients recently on the CDC.gov, there was a very nice one page summary of the data for, for pregnant ladies, first, second, third trimester, summarizing the data and final recommendations. It was an easy one page printout I was able to give to this lady trying to encourage her to get that vaccine. Regardless of the question, Dr. Weiss and Dr. Bell and all of Amarillo's health professionals ask that you seek information from a reputable source. Dr. Bell adds that it's too early to let your guard down, so we have to continue health and safety practices. And for a list of the mentioned reputable sources for pregnant people that the doctors discuss, visit our website. We've got a link for you, myhighplains.com.